Edgar TV. How do there guys and welcome back to Edgar TV and today what we're going to do is take a look at a little bit I saw whilst watching the World Championships recently. Now those of you that watch the channel know I'm a bit of an eagle eyed yeah, I, I like my little bits of uh, Easter eggs and my little bit of like errors. Was this an error? Or are BDO titles now being dismissed? Now, as you may know, the BDO has recently come to an end, so that organisation no longer exists. Are Sky now going to say that the history of that event does no longer count, which, as you can see at the graphic at the side here, John Park, two-time world champion, two-time PDC world champion, one-time BDO champion when he won the event in 1994. Now, this might not seem too significant, but by making this change, and if this change isn't a typo, it might be a typo, it might have been an oversight, if this is not, and if this is the way forward, that John's now going to be referred to as a two-time world champion, that means that we're going to rewrite history in a way that's going to make some major changes here. And I've wrote down a couple here to share with you some of the changes that rewrite in history if the demise of the BDO means that it's no longer going to be recognised as a world championship. So, Phil Taylor will be down from 16 time champion of the world down to 14 times after winning two BDO world titles. Raymond Van Barneveld drops from five world titles to one. So, if John Parts can be advertised as a, as a two time world champion, logically that means if Barneveld returns from coming through Q School, he will have to be referred to as a one time world champion, not a five time world champion. But remember, this might be a typo. Just so keep that in mind. Dennis Priestley drops from a two time world champion to a one time world champion. But what's more interesting is there's some people now that are not world champions, according to this logic, which include. Eric Bristow, John Lowe, Martin Adams, to name just a couple of people who are no longer world champions in this model and in this system. What do you think, guys? Was this a typo? Was this an oversight? If not, we've rewritten history, haven't we? We've now got a one-time world champion going to Q School, not a five-time world champion. We've now got a 14-time world champion as the pinnacle of our game, not a 16-time world champion. Let me know in the comments section, did you see this and what do you think? Um, do you think that th this could be the way forward, that it gets struck off and that only the PDC titles count? Or do you think it was a bit of an oversight and maybe it'll change it in the future? Let me know in the comments section what you think, guys. I'll catch you soon for some more Edgar TV.